What's good y'all today we got another video and today is going to be an interesting one as you see from the title we're going to be talking about a 3DS game that goes for $4,000 and this is not clickbait if we go to price charting look at these prices for the loose complete and the new prices it's honestly insane and don't get it twisted if we go to eBay and look at recent solds of this game it's honestly mind blowing but my mission today is to go ahead and get this on my system because you know we got the physical version right and we're gonna pop it in and go ahead and see what it's looking like how the gameplay is and see why this game is four thousand dollars hopping into it we have to listen to the original soundtrack let's give it a listen okay okay that's enough but let's go ahead and hop into it as you see barbie groom and glam pups let's go ahead and see what barbie got to say to us hi it's me barbie i hear you want to train and take care of your very own dog yes that's what i'm here for that is what i'm here for barbie first i'll tell you how to choose a pup i'll show you how to groom it dress it up and enter it into performances and as you see this is giving me heavy heavy nintendo dogs vibes is it just me they're letting me choose a pup we gotta go ahead and groom it dress it up and put it in performances like i said this game was definitely taking those from nintendo dogs but i picked my dog let's see what barbie gotta say if you groom your dog regularly it'll be quite happy to perform well in your future events okay okay so as you see we gotta groom it this is the grooming area you can bring your dog here for a quick clean grooming will also increase your dog's happiness i'm not gonna read all these little cues by barbie come on now we know how to clean a dog we did it enough times in enough years on Nintendo dogs i'm a Nintendo dogs og let's go ahead and give this dog a quick clean and okay this is taking a little longer than usual what's going on here this dog must be really dirty it doesn't look dirty but it must be really dirty they got me cleaning this dog for about 30 seconds just to pass the cleaning portion and of course our dog is nice and happy after that grooming let's see what barbie got to say now great job great now that your pup is nice and happy let's go ahead and check out the boutique and this is what i'm saying this is giving me heavy Nintendo dog vibes, but hey, let's go to the store and I'm assuming we're gonna go ahead and dress up our dog, which, how do y'all feel about this? Do y'all dress up y'all dogs? I was never a person that did that, but I know there's definitely people out there that treat their dogs like humans, but I have nothing against it. If you could afford it, if you want it on your dog, go ahead and do you, but let's go ahead and put a bow on this dog because I feel like a bow is a nice touch, especially on a female dog. We gotta go ahead and put a shirt on it, I guess. I don't know how I feel about a shirt on a dog, but that's about it. As you train to trick, your pup's experience will increase the more experience it will have the more tricks the more rewards yada 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 okay we get it barbie we're experienced we know how this works and as you see we're about to train our dog some tricks which this is much easier in the games than in real life if you ever actually try to teach a dog a trick it's definitely way harder than it looks but as you see we have a few different options we could choose here for different selections of tricks let's go ahead and pick this one this one looks pretty decent this shouldn't be too hard and barbie here we go with giving me a bunch of different instructions be sure to reward your dog after it learns each trick i got you i got you as you see a little quick simple slide of the pen and bang the dog did our trick which I was a little easier than expected, but I guess I'll give it a treat. I'm not going to be a bad owner. Let's go ahead and give the dog a treat so it's nice and happy, and he's on my happy side. They want me to choose another trick to do, but eh, I'm going to go ahead and practice this one one more time, and I guess you just do the same thing over again. Okay, that's uh, definitely not what I was expecting, but yeah, I I'm done with this game. This game is definitely not for me. If I'm going to play a game like this, I'm going to just hop on me some Nintendo dogs. Come on now. Come on now. I'm not going to play this Barbie clone. So yeah, why is this... Barbie Nintendo dogs knockoff going for four thousand dollars. That's the real question here. Obviously, sometimes the value of a video game is because of the quality of the game, but this isn't that type of situation. This game is so expensive because it's just really rare. Obviously, Barbie is not like a huge, you know, triple A game, so they probably didn't make a ton of these. And during this time on the 3DS, they're making a bunch of different variations of Barbie games. Like I don't know, I'm gonna pop up a few on the screen just to give you some ideas of what I'm talking about. But it seems like they're really trying to do some Nintendo. 10 dogs type of energy and go ahead and just make a bunch of different sequels prequels uh quadruples i don't even know what to call it they just made a ton of different barbie games and i'm just guessing this was the one that they didn't decide to make too many of and we weren't really on shelves and for that reason today the game is very rare i just find it interesting and kind of funny that some of these games go for so much money and there's people that are willing to pay this price there's some 3ds collectors that will pay the three four five thousand dollars just to have this on their shelf but yeah, this video was interesting. I'm definitely interested in making some more videos like this. So let me know in the comments what you think of this video. And if this video hits 300 likes, I will make a video kind of like this. I got a couple ideas in mind. So make sure y'all hit that like button. But all I know is if you have a cousin, sister, auntie, a grandma, doesn't matter. If you think they had this game growing up or, you know, in the past, make sure you give them a call because, hey, they might be sitting on $5,000 in the drawer that they don't even know about. But like I said, hopefully y'all enjoyed this video. I'll see y'all next time.